I'm Sue Olinger, teacher here at Burr Intermediate School and alumni of Teacher Space Camp. You're watching My Long Island on Fios One. Today we have the Long Island Digital Summit, which is truly Long Island's first large-scale mass digital event. We have speakers from Google, Facebook, uh, JetBlue, Chris McCann from 1-800-Flowers, as well as others. We have about 400 people uh, coming today, or more, and uh, the reaction has been huge. We've had a lot of press on social media, a lot of press in traditional media, um, because there has been an event out here. It's such a hot topic. It changes every day, and people are just thirsty for information. It's more trying to understand how it works, um, the data that goes behind it, um, and really how to use that. You know, everyone's very comfortable with television and print, um, but they're not necessarily as comfortable with, with the digital mediums like search and, and mobile. Um, so typically, that that fear and that un not knowing is, is really where the where the issues um, come from. You know, there's going to be a lot of talk about social, a lot of talk about other things. But really, the the next evolution, the next thing that's coming is mobile. It's it's not coming. It's here. Um, so it's really taking taking that, understanding it, and really leveraging it to, to grow the business. I think when it comes to mobile, um, the direction that people should go in is, is simplifying for the user and thinking of the user first. Um, and I, we had a really good mobile breakout session where um, Amit Shah from One Eight Hundred Flowers made a really good point, where he said uh, mobile and, and all these other platforms are irrelevant. What you really want to do is create. Um, a, a really fruitful conversation with your customer. And if you think about it that way, um, you can organically slide in mobile, video, uh, any sort of digital advertising and marketing um, because it's built on, on the conversation with the user and that's ultimately your end goal. We're speaking to some of the, the greatest minds in the digital world from some of the greatest companies, uh, including Google, Facebook, Mashable, 1-800-Flowers, JetBlue. Uh, there's just a, a lot of great speakers. What was working six months ago has already evolved into something else, and I think that's part of the reason why we're having such a big turnout here today, because everyone just wants to be able to stay ahead, and it's difficult. At 1-800-Flowers, we're ultimately in the business of delivering smiles. And in order to do that, we have to be in touch with our customers wherever they go. So over the years, we've always embraced new technologies because what we find is new technology changes consumer behavior, or sometimes it's the other way around. So whether it was embracing the internet back in the early 90s, it's riding that wave, or certainly today embracing mobile, social, and local commerce capabilities is really where the consumer is going. We're not smart enough to know what the consumer will gravitate to. So it's our job to be experimenting with the consumer and to be there when the consumer makes that decision. Being successful in digital is not just checking the boxes of, okay, I have an app, I'm in social, I have this, I have that. You know, that, that doesn't mean that you're doing a good job in the space or that you're successful in the space. I'd much rather you focus in on one or two of those areas and do a really good job at it. And it really depends on the kind of business you are, right? If you um, are a small business owner versus an airline, I think the way that you approach and use digital is very different. And so what I would say to the audience is really think about your particular business needs and think about how you can take away some of the things that come out of this event, in particular how it will impact your business. Everything that you knew yesterday is no longer relevant and everything you think is going to happen tomorrow probably is not. So it's very, very engaging and it's nice to hear from people who are doing it every day rather than those of us in the marketing environment who dabble in it or have people doing it, it's nice to know what other people think of as the future for digital. What I hope that everyone here takes away from today is that this is the world we live in. This is the world that's changing rapidly. In order to grow our businesses, in order to grow the Long Island economy, we all have to embrace this and be on the forefront of experimentation.